You're watching Tag TV. From Kashmir to Kanyakumari, India has a spell-binding mosaic of culture, tradition, languages and an extraordinary mingling civilization. Keeping its age-old culture maintained today, the country is taking huge strides in the path of development. Hello, I'm your host Karim Zimik and today in our episode of My India, we bring you some of the stories that will give a glimpse of our country's diversity. On the auspicious occasion of Jagannath Rath Yatra in Puri city of Odisha, sand artist Subal Moharana has made world's smallest chariot of Lord Jagannath in Bhubaneswar city. Have a look. The festival of Jagannath Yatra is considered as the biggest and the most auspicious festival celebrated in the state of Odisha. Every year, the festival is celebrated with much grandeur and zeal by devotees coming across from all over the country. In such a scenario, artisans from Odisha, which has been a land of ancient historical art forms and crafts, are coming up their artworks to showcase their devotion to the deity. On the same lines, eminent sand artist Sobal Morana from Bhubaneswar city of Odisha has made small chariots of Jagannath which is said to be the smallest in the world till now. Puri me sara vishwa ka sabse bada rath bana raha hai. Abhi yeh vishwa ka sabse smallest chariot. Yeh banane ke liye humko char panch ghanta la samaya laga. Aar yeh last year jo banaya tha yeh one point टू पॉइंट थ्री सेंटीमीटर था इस पर हाफ इंच में ये बनाया है टोटल मोराना हैज मेड थ्री मिनेचर रेप्लिकास ऑफ नंदी घोष द चैरियट ऑफ लॉर्ड जगन्नाथ तलतवाल द चैरियट ऑफ लॉर्ड बालभद्र एंड दर्बदलन द चैरियट ऑफ देवी सुभद्रा लॉर्ड जगन्नाथ चैरियट इज टू पॉइंट थ्री मिलीमीटर इन हाइट एंड वन पॉइंट नाइन मिलीमीटर वाइट Made from wooden pieces, clothes, and fabric colors, it took nearly 15 hours and 20 minutes for the artist to complete all the three pieces. It is also decorated with two parrots, the Dhinoti and Patita Pavan flag, like the original one. Abhi ye neem ka jo lakri mein Jagannath banaya, ye. सेंटीमीटर में बनाया जगन्नाथ ये थोड़ा सा माइक्रो में दिखाई पड़ेगा ये आँख खाली आँख में नहीं दिखाया जाता है जैसा जगन्नाथ का सिक्सटीन व्हील्स जो चारियट इसमें भी ऐसा ही सिक्सटीन व्हील्स है ये लकड़ी पूरा तुलसी में नीम में और बेलो बेला बोलते हैं वो उसी लकड़ी में बनाया है सब जैसा जगन्नाथ जी का जैसे रथ का for the same, Morana has been felicitated with a number of records and awards. It has been said that a small man can cast a very big shadow. This saying has been brought to light by three Hindu artisans in Merad city of Uttar Pradesh who have carved verses from the Holy Quran on the gate of an ancient mosque and have been doing so for years, thus serving as an example of religious harmony among both the communities. All the religions of the world inculcate equality and brotherhood of mankind and the virtue of tolerance. These words by Mahatma Gandhi very well explain that no matter whichever religion one may think of, the teachings of unity and harmony is common among in each one. These three men are Vinod, Papu and Dharmvi. They have been tirelessly working to finish the task of restoring the Shahi Jama Mosque in Meerut city. They are engraving verses of the Holy Quran on the main gates of the mosque despite of being Hindus. We have come to the 
मस्जिदों में ये तरह यही होता है और वैसे मस्जिदों के अलावा मंदिरों में भी क्या है गुरुद्वारों में भी क्या है कोई सरकारी जगह होती है उसमें भी मिल जाता है काम या प्राइवेट कोठी भी होती है उसमें भी काम कर लेते हैं इसके बाद नहीं जहाँ मिल जाता है जहाँ करना पड़ता है कोठियों में काम किया मंदिर में काम किया गुरुद्वारा में काम किया है मस्जिदों में काम किया है हाँ सही भाई बंदी के हिसाब से रहते हैं कहीं भी जाते हैं भाई बंदी के हिसाब से रहते हैं मुस्लिम भाई 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 हमको कोई परेशानी नहीं है कहीं भी काम कर सकते हैं This mosque is one of the oldest monuments in Meerut city which was built around 700 years ago by Sultan Nasiruddin Shah. These Hindu carvers have carved Arabic verses of Quran in 40 mosques around India including the famous Jama Mosque in New Delhi. Having carved verses from different holy texts on different religious monuments These carvers have been acknowledged across the city for their work. This mosque, which is a marvelous piece of ancient Mughal architecture in the country, is being preserved and beautified by these artisans. हम कुरान की आयत एक कागज पर लिखकर उनको देते हैं और उस कागज को सामने रखकर फिर वो पत्थर पर उन आयत को किंदा करते हैं. ये तो इस तरीके से एक दरवाजा हमारा जामा मस्जिद का बन गया है और वो बहुत शानदार दरवाजा है और वो भी इन्हीं का कारीगरों का कारनामा है कि जिन्होंने ये इसको अंजाम दिया द वर्क ऑफ दीज स्टोन कावर्स इज एन इंस्पिरेशन फॉर एवरी वन टू कट अक्रॉस रिलीजियस लाइन एंड रिसाइड हारमोनियसली विदाउट एनी डिस्क्रिमिनेशन Now a round up of some of the major stories that made news recently. Indian designer Vaishali Shadangule held her first show at the Paris Fashion Week at the bucolic garden of a Parisian high school. She is the first Indian woman invited as a guest member of the event and only the second Indian fashion designer after Rahul Mishra in 2019. After a 6 months long selection process with several virtual interviews the 43 year old designer was selected amongst candidates from all around the world I think that was the dream for me and uh, I think it's 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 now it's reality and uh, of course uh, I was very excited nervous and I felt like big responsibility uh, for me because i'm the first woman from india showcasing here we always say like made in india you know uh, fabric is from india embroidery is from india but we don't say like oh this garment and design at the international platform it's from india vashali s's breath collection is inspired by nature and its shapes every piece is made from traditionally hand woven fabric it also echoes the covid-19 pandemic where everyone was struggling for breath the designer who herself suffered of covid-19 said the last border village in the northern kathua district of jammu and kashmir territory has become one of the first villages in the valley to be 100% vaccinated against covid-19 health officials said all adults over 18 years of age in bobia village More than 300 kilometers from Srinagar, the summer capital have been vaccinated with both doses. ये हमें बताते हुए बहुत खुशी हो रही है कि विबिया विलेज जो है ये हिरानगर ब्लॉक के अंदर आता है तो ये कठुआ डिस्ट्रिक्ट का पहला विलेज है जहां 100% टारगेट अचीव किया गया है वैक्सीनेशन का 18 प्लस में भी और 45 प्लस में भी जितने एलिजिबल थे वो सारे हमारे ये वैक्सीनेटेड हैं लोग. India has so far administered around 390 million vaccine doses. the most in the world after china giving at least one dose to 31% of its estimated adult population of 944 million an elderly couple in india's southern hyderabad city has been filling potholes on roads with their savings to prevent accidents 73 year old software designer engineer gangadhar tilak katnam along with his 64 year old wife venkateshwari gadam were seen filling potholes all by themselves 
using bitumen mixed with aggregate for the safety of the commuters. While going on this road, I witnessed many, many accidents, number of accidents. So that made me to go on filling this one. When I tried to tell the police or the government, they never cared it. So I myself thought to fill it and started going on filling the pathway. The couple that has been engaging in this activity for 11 years has been using their pension money to fill up the potholes. India is a country where Sufism has not just flourished but has also become a way of integrating different religious communities. Even today, the teachings of these saints inform the lives of people and act as a guiding force for many. So today we will take you to the shrine of Saint Hazrat Nahar Sayyid where people of all faiths assembled to seek the blessings of a holy saints. Situated in the Mansour district of Madhya Pradesh, the shrine of Sufi saint Hazrat Nahar Sayyid Baba has served as a signature of communal harmony for generations, which is thronged by a large number of devotees every day from across the nation, irrespective of their religion. Regarded as one of the greatest Sufi saints, Hazrat Nahar Sayyid Baba throughout his life spread the message of Sufism and peace. यहां के बाबा साहब हर मुरादें पूरी करते हैं सबका काम भी करते हैं और हमारा भी रेस्टोरेंट अभी नया डला हुआ है बस बाबा से यही दुआ मांगते हैं कि हमारा रेस्टोरेंट अच्छे से चले आशीर्वाद बनाए रखें मंदिर मस्जिद भी जाते हर जगह यहां पे और हम हिंदू समाज के ये नहीं है सब जगह गाना जाना रहता है बाबा की दुआ भी कबूल होते हैं इट इज बिलीव्ड दैट ऑन विजिटिंग दिस 455 ईयर ओल्ड होली श्राइन डेवोटीज हु विश टू हैव चिल्ड्रन आर ब्लेस्ड for fulfillment of wishes, devotees bathe in the pond outside the Dargah, leave their old clothes and get dressed up in brand new clothes before offering their prayers to the deity. Every year, Uris along with the Grand Fair is organized on the day of the Hindu festival of Holi at this Dargah. Earlier, the Urs was a day celebration at the Dargah, but since the last 44 years, the Urs celebrations have become a three-day affair. It is believed that saint fulfills the wishes of all and nobody returns empty-handed from here. Hindu Muslim Yakta ke pratik hai. Yahaan par vigat kai saalo se Hindu Muslim Yakta ka मेला गिरता है यह मेला यह उर्स होली के दिन मनाया जाता है होली किसी भी वक्त आओ चाहे रमजान में आओ मोहरम में आओ कभी भी आओ लेकिन होली के दिन ही यह उर्स यह मेला गिरता है और उस पर जायरीन पूरे भारत में हिंदू के साथ साथ मुसलमानों के साथ जितनी भी हिंदू आते हैं वो लगभग बराबर ही होते हैं और खास तौर से गुरुवार के दिन शुक्रवार और रविवार को तो यहां एक तरह से मेला लगा रहता है सरकार नाहर सिंह में नमन तो लाले हिंदू मुस्लिम एकता की जिंदगी मिसाल है। Since ages, the Sufi saints like Hazrat Nahar Sayyid Baba have propagated the message of spiritualism and harmony in our country, and their teachings are still playing a significant role in strengthening the threat of secularism. And now we will meet a five-year-old budding boxer from New Delhi who has left all professional boxes behind and made a world record of fastest 100 punches in 60 seconds. Take a look. If one had to guess who has made the record for the fastest 100 punches, then one may think about names like Floyd Mayweather Jr., Richard Garson or Mike Tyson. But the record belongs to a five-year-old boxer named Arindam Gaur, a New Delhi-based budding boxer who aspires to become like Mary Com and Vijay Singh when he grows up. I Mary Com ma'am ke liye Olympic ke liye best wishes leta Arindam, who is a budding boxer, took 13 seconds and 7 deciseconds to perform 100 boxing punches to register the record. Arindam's father, Arun Gaur, brought a punching bag for Arindam for his fifth birthday as he had been asking for one. 
when Arindam's father saw a newspaper story where a kid had made a world record and told about it to Arindam. The five-year-old decided to make a similar record. Arindam's father started his boxing training and discovered he was serious for boxing. It is then when they approached Golden Book of World Records and the record had been accepted. हमने सोचा कि इसको ट्रेनिंग कराते हैं बट कोरोना कोरोना लॉकडाउन था तो हम ट्रेनिंग तो इसकी करा नहीं पाए घर में ही ट्रेनिंग हुई तो घर में ट्रेनिंग कराता था मैं और ये जो है सुबह डेढ़ घंटा लगभग प्रैक्टिस करता था और शाम को भी लगभग डेढ़ घंटा प्रैक्टिस करता था और प्रैक्टिस का मतलब वर्ल्ड रिकॉर्ड का इसको इतना शौक था कि जब ये थक जाता है तो मैं कहता है कि ना बेटा अभी नहीं करना है तो मत करो पर फिर वर्ल्ड रिकॉर्ड नहीं बनेगा तो कहते नहीं पापा फिर ये दब फिर से प्रैक्टिस करने लग जाता था Little Arindam is continuing his boxing training and wishes to be a great boxer like his idols. Next we bring you a few short stories about the recent developments and happenings from around the world in our section World in Focus. Furukawa Electric Company has been developing fiber technology for years. The company has started developing cutting-edge technologies in the field of energy, information, heat conduction, connection and storing. Furukawa has developed and released an industrial laser. Fiber laser of Furukawa has some strong features like high beam quality, time stability, high reliability and high effect. This enables deep melting, high speed processing and a reduction of welding defect. Because of this, the strain on ice is less than general arc welding. Kuchiraga fiber laser を使って加工の評価をしている実験室です。えっとお客様が来られて一緒に実験をしたり、開発したレーザーを評価したりしています。こちらへどうぞ。こちらが古川電工で製造製造販売している。12キロワットのファイバーレーザーです。中で作られた高出力の光がこちらの光ファイバーの中を通って加工室の中に伝送されます。で外から入ってきたレーザー光が光ファイバーの中を通りましてこのような加工用の光学系ガルバノスキャナーを通って加工点の金属を加工する。If we look around the ongoing industrial scenario taking care of environment regulations including fuel gas usage and needs of car weight saving has become important. This transformation of car industry seeks cutting edge technology like that of Furukawa. Furukawa's industrial fiber laser is used for the welding of car body and parts including aluminum processing, welding of motor and battery. The most distinctive feature is that the technology is paperless which means that its exposure does not provoke any spark to make precise welding. It is hoped that in the future technology that removes rust will also be developed. Furukawa's fiber laser system is cultivated on the basis of fiber optic technology and will contribute to solve the problems of global warming and zero carbon emission. Furukawa's technology is playing an integral part in establishing a sustainable environment for the future. The inventor of a jet suit that lets the wearer fly like Iron Man has unveiled his newest suit powered by electricity. Richard Browning, founder of UK-based Gravity Industries, believed that switching from jet fuel to an electric-powered suit is part of their desire to push the boundaries of what's possible. So the electric version is really, I suppose, a physical manifestation of our desire to constantly push the boundaries of what's possible. You know, it is right on the margin of what's possible because of energy density and batteries. And yet we've actually managed to go and get it to work today. Honestly, 24 hours ago, it wasn't really achieving what we needed, and we've put our money where our mouth is and actually demonstrated it live to people. So it's the beginning. As battery te technology gets better and better, it will get better and better, and we'll see where we get to finally. 
the jet fuel powered suit can hit speeds in excess of 80 mph and is technically capable of reaching an altitude of 12000 feet although for safety purposes it is flown lower the electric suit has um enough power to run a small street of houses it is phenomenal how much energy you need in a small form factor to get a human off the ground um and it it really just brings home how much energy you have in you know gasoline or diesel or those fuels so we we're getting there it'll only ever get better the jet suit has previously been tested by paramedics in england's remote rocket lake district region to get them to people in danger or distress in a fraction of time it would take to travel by car or on foot traditional dyed fabrics are fluttering softly as they are hung to dry up these beautiful design fabrics will be used later to make yukata japanese casual kimono these traditional dyeing workshop in tokyo's idogawa ward has been in business for over 100 years they use a 300 years old technique of hand dyeing known as chusen originated in the early edo period 1912えっとうちのおじいさんがえっとまあ昭和の29年に逃げてきましてえっとこの場でえっとこの土地でえっと工場を作り始めましたでうちのまあ抽選っていう技法なんですけれどもまあ4つの工程に分かれておりましてまあ1つが後ろで見ていただいているまあ白い単毛のからスタートしてで板場で柄付けをして荒野で染色をして水元でまあ残った余分の染料とかのりを全部落としてあげた後またこういうふうにあの天気の外で干されるようになります。Unlike machine printing, this method dyes the threads of the fabric rather than just the surface of the cloth. This allows superimposition of delicately illustrated images, refined expression of color gradations, and double-sided imprint of images. No two pieces of dyed fabric are exactly alike, producing subtle taste variations in every dyeing job. Finally, drying takes place outside on the roof under the natural sun. This shop in Tokyo specializes in selling traditional dyed fabric that can be tailored later into yukata. Yukata というのはですね、あの日本人があのお風呂をですね、入るときに、それがあのだんだんだんだん衣装として。えー、少しずつ外に出てきたわけでしてあのそういう意味で浴衣の柄というのは非常に一つ一つの柄が派手でございますし見たいということであれば例えば花火大会だとかあるいはお祭りだとかこういった時が一番多いんじゃないでしょうかね。マスターリングアートフィショナリーダイングクローズフェブリックスティックスヨーズタンクストジャパニスアーティスンスアンディプリザーフクラフス Which has been passed to generations after generations, that these beautiful yukata can be still seen today in many places in Japan. That's all we have for you this week. Your comments and suggestions are important to us. Do give us your feedback at myindia@nin.com. I'm your host Skyrim, and it's goodbye from the entire production team. Subscribe Tag TV YouTube channel and press the notification button.